it's your girl Simba and welcome to Simba Spot where I do my thing. If you're new here today, welcome to the jungle. If you're old here, welcome back to the motherfucking jungle. You feel me? And don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe this video. Today is not going to be a vlog video. It's going to be a hair tutorial. As you can tell, I look crazy. Hair wild, just crazy right now, but we're going to get into the video. Uh, today I'm going to be doing crochet locks. Me so. I do a lot of freestyling. I do my hair. My mom in the background. I do my hair a lot. So I'm gonna show you. I'm gonna be using this Bobby Boss crochet locks. They're they're not butterfly locks, but they're crochet locks in the length of 36 inches. I love my long hair. And I'm gonna basically pretty much show you guys how I finesse. Honestly, I had no real insight on what I wanted to do. I'm very indecisive, but I know I wanted to do something different. So I just went into the beauty supply store and just picked some colors and hopefully it turns out nice. So I hope you guys like this video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Please follow my Instagram. It's gonna be right here. I'm gonna put it right there. Go ahead and click it, follow that Instagram, and everything that I use will be in the description below. Um, yeah, so let's get into this hair tutorial. Hope you guys like the video. Okay, what's up guys? It is the next day, so as you can see, my hair is fully braided. It took me about two and a half hours to braid my hair. I decided, since it was so late, that I'll just go ahead and finish this video the next day. Um, my hair has been up in this bun for a while. I did go to the gym. And basically what I did was I took my finger and I just parted randomly and I braided. I used um, some edge booster on the roots. I didn't use that much because it makes your hair like sticky and i don't like that feeling after when i'm going to take my braids out but you put a little bit on your roots you comb it through and you just braid your hair down i did that throughout my hair i have about 48 braids and what you want to do is you want to take your pack of crochet locks you want to count them and make sure that you know how many braids to have each pack of if you get this pack this pack has uh 24 in there and i got two packs so i have 48 locks also uh, who else you want to make sure you moisturize your hair as well before you put the locks on there and i braid my hair all the way down because i don't like having my hair free especially if you want to keep it styling for a while because your hair tends to get matted with the lock and that's just that's too much. But I'm gonna show you guys what my hair looks like down. It's gonna be a little crazy because I've had it in spun for a while. But yeah, you wanna braid your hair and then I'll show you guys after I've done the back because it don't make sense for me to sit here and try to do the back on camera. So I'm just gonna do the back and then show you guys the um, how to do the front. It does that make sense? I don't know, I guess. But let me show you guys real quick my braids and pretty much they hold like this they're a little curly because of this bloom so yeah don't forget to like comment and subscribe below and let me know how you like this method you know what i'm saying because i am freestyle and i do my hair a lot my stuff and i freestyle a lot so it might as well just record Okay guys, so I'm at the top. Excuse that pimple up there. That guy's big. <laughs> but now I'm at the top. I'm on the last three. And I'm gonna basically show you guys how to do this. So when you get the crochet lock, it looks like this. I don't know if you can see this. Whatever, so it's like pretty close. You wanna unravel it. pull it apart basically so you can get your finger through it like this and then you're gonna pull out your braid and what I like to do is go under it like this 
you're gonna put it in there, close the latch. So it looks like that, and then you're gonna pull it through. Unhook it, and then you're gonna pull the braid and lock through the hole. And then you're gonna pull it. Um, it should look something like this. Now what you're gonna do is alternate the sides and you see how this is turning this way? So you're gonna turn it this way to unravel it and you're gonna put your braid through it, basically twirl it around your braid. So I like to just twist it one time first, twist it the opposite way so it comes loose, push it over your braid, put your finger around it and then switch it again. So you're gonna keep doing the same thing over and over. Untwist, rub around, smooth with your finger, let go. Untwist, rub around, smooth with your finger, let go. Untwist, wrap around, smooth with your finger, let go. And just repeat until there's no more of your hair showing. And when I get lower, I like to just push up on it because that just makes sure no braid is showing, especially since I'm using a different color than my hair. And that's it. You're just gonna keep going until your braid is covered. And if your hair is like mine, it's pretty long, so you're gonna be twisting for a while. Basically, keep going. When you get to the end and it looks like this, you wanna keep going. So you just unravel, push it in, roll it across, and then rub it together like that. And this is what it looks like. So I'm gonna show you guys again. Edges. Excuse them edges. Go in. Take it, open it up. Put your finger through it. Your ring finger is the easiest if you're right handed. Ring finger through thumb and ring finger. Put it in there, clamp it, pull it through. Open it back up, put the braid and lock through, pull it through. And now you're gonna pull the lock till it gets to the end. Pull the lock till it gets to the end. And then you're gonna cross them over. Okay. And you're basically just gonna unravel and twist.
everybody don't forget to like comment and subscribe to your girl channel if you like this look and you want to try it out this is pretty easy it took about um two hours and 30 minutes to braid and then it took me about um I want to say maybe two hours and 30 minutes to put this in and yeah so in reality four five six hours but we'll see how long these last they should last pretty long because I took my time with them I may add some little razzle dazzle to it like some more color and stuff but um, I'm gonna show you guys the finished look when I do my edges and my makeup and I'm dressed you guys but let me know if you like them don't forget to follow me on Instagram at Simba it's 3B's 3A's underscore so yep. hope you guys like this they aren't that heavy either actually they're pretty light and I was gonna butterfly them but I kind of like them like this because they're like super duper light and I don't I'm short I don't want to be dragged to the floor you know what I'm saying so yeah, that's pretty lit. I'm gonna do my edges and my makeup, and I will be back. Um, I can't wait that talk. I gotta play that game real quick. He didn't know about that game. They dying with me. Why not? So, this is what my hair looks like. <laughs> Done. That bitch got her makeup on. This is it. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to your girl YouTube channel for the tricks. And these have been in for about, um, I know it's a lot of background, but whatever. These have been in for about a week. Still look good.